Paul Stell of 90 Day Fiancé reveals Karen has been lavishly spending money from their joint account ever since they broke up. The 38-year-old reality star and his soon-to-be ex-wife have been in the spotlight since late 2021. A big reason is the surveillance video that showed Karen assaulting her husband. In the video, viewers saw Paul sitting on the couch when his wife grabbed and pulled his hair. Most 90 Day Fiancé viewers felt uncomfortable watching the video, especially because the assault occurred in front of the couple's first child, Pierre. After the assault video was released, many assumed Paul would file for divorce from his wife, at least for the sake of his two sons. Eventually, the Kentucky native decided to leave his messy relationship and took his children to his mother's house. Soon, Karine shared her side of the story and claimed that she didn't abuse Paul. She broke into tears talking about her sons and affirmed that she has a good mother. Paul returned to his house and reunited his wife with their kids. However, he has still decided to move on from his tumultuous marriage with Karine. Dot in an Instagram story, Paul shared the latest update about his relationship with his wife. He revealed that he finds it hilarious that Karine has already decided to date again. He wrote, my soon-to-be ex-wife apparently subscribed to every possible dating application available and charged them all to the joint account. Paul added, I am now adding up over a couple hundred dollars in subscriptions. Still, he is happy because he spent some quality time with Ethan and Pierre at the zoo. Dot this rush to date a new man seems like a harsh move from Karen, but Paul is keeping his cool. He isn't complaining as the money she is using falls under marital assets. In fact, he is just glad that Karen will be out of his hair soon. All the clues suggest that Paul and Karen's relationship is unrepairable and they may go through with the divorce this time. In one of Karen's recent posts, she shared a lengthy message about how she spent the holidays away from her two children. She blamed it all on Paul and called him immature. She also made a bold move by removing her husband's photos from her Instagram grid. While everyone saw Karen physically abuse Paul, she urged her followers to respect her as a human being and a woman. She said viewers do not know the full story, therefore, they should refrain from commenting. It is heartbreaking to see the 90-day fiancé couple cut ties after having two adorable children, but maybe it is for the best. Karine and Paul will never be able to return to the love they once shared. 90-day fiancé viewers hope the two will discuss their split mutually and come up with solutions that keep everyone happy, especially their sons.